Hi, people. We hope you're having an amazing day today. Whenever we get the opportunity to explore a mother-daughter relationship on TV, we cherish it so deeply. The reason why is that we believe the romance between two partners is overdone at this point and we don't get enough productions about parental relations or even platonic friendships, which is a shame. Among these overshadowed human relationships, the mother-daughter one hits us the most since we believe it's one of the dearest and most complicated interactions that a person can experience. The love and care that is received from a mother are unparalleled to anything else in life. That being said, there is also the fact that we have scenarios such as the infamous Mommy Dearest. We believe Netflix is one of those platforms that attempt to portray all these relations in a wide variety of shows. However, it's a rare occasion for the platform to focus a show on these relations alone. When we think about a series with a specific focus on mother-daughter ties, the only show that comes to our mind is Ginny and Georgia. Ginny and Georgia are following a single mother and her mixed-race teenage daughter. The two try to hold on to living alone, as they have no support mechanism outside of one another. This doesn't mean that they are suffering. Even though life is not easy for single mothers and women in general, these two manage to find their way through it. Although women's empowerment is a huge theme in the series, the relationship between Ginny and Georgia makes the show what it is. As you can see, even with a single season the series has managed to leave a major impact on us. Now we cannot wait for season 2 of the show to be released so that we can confirm this is a series that's worth watching. Thankfully, we have a season 2 confirmation already with the expectation of a release date around fall 2022. We also expect the new season to have a trailer at the end of summer 2022, which will be a perfect farewell to the summer gift for us. We anticipate the new season to welcome back Brian Howie as Georgia, Antonia Gentry as Ginny, Diesel Latraca as Austin, Jennifer Robertson as Ellen, Felix Mallard as Marcus, Sarah Wasteglass as Maxine, Scott Porter as Mayor Paul Randolph, and Raymond Black as Joe. Now, even though we're not surprised that Ginny and Georgia have been this successful, we're surprised that they managed to overcome drama so swiftly. When season one got initially released, it received lots of praise, as well as criticism. The criticism was focusing on a single element, the infamous commentary of Taylor Swift and her past relationships. Even Swift herself shared on Twitter that she was disappointed in Netflix for attempting to drag a woman artist for her personal life. After all this drama, many fans were worried that the series will not be renewed for a new season. And yet, Antonia Gentry's touching post on Instagram has worked like a charm in damage control and rescued the show. As someone who grew up feeling voiceless and unimportant, and who didn't see herself reflected on screen, Ginny Miller was finally a reprieve. Finally, in a character who was just as confused and imperfect as I was gets a chance to exist. Ginny Miller, though fictional, is a character who reflects all of life's contradictions and imperfections. I fell in love with playing Ginny Miller because she is a character who dares to be flawed, a character who tries her hardest to melt into the world around her seamlessly, but is consistently told no. She is a character among many in the show who implicate us all. She shows us our own biases, prejudices, and injustices, she said in her post, underlining that it's unfair to judge the entire show based on a single line. She also highlighted that the audience should be able to understand the difference between a character's thoughts and the showrunner's thoughts since those two are completely different things. What do you think about Ginny and Georgia? Do you think Taylor Swift was right to be upset about the aforementioned comment? Let us know what you think in the comments below and don't forget to like, subscribe and share the video. Thank you for watching. See you soon.